Student loan debt continues to hold our economy back and is perhaps the greatest burden facing young professionals, students, working families, and several other groups of people in Minnesota. Here in the state of Minnesota, the average debt for a student who has debt is $30,894, putting it at the fifth highest in the country. 70% of people who graduate from a four-year school have debt now. And often finding a job that will allow them to live and to pay off their student debt can be a challenge. Our students currently pay the third highest tuition and fees in the nation, and even after financial aid, our students still face some of the highest costs in the country. But this amount of debt is something that my parents and my families don't see in a developing country. Due to their large debt and consequently low credit scores, these students will struggle taking out more loans to do normal milestones in their life. I have friends who have recently graduated that have avoided careers in the teaching profession based on their student debt load and the salary that they'd receive as a teacher. And this is a family, I mean, my, I'm a teacher, my wife's a teacher, we have a family, we both have pretty stable jobs and we're suffering this like constant weight of pressure from our student loan debt and it's really, really hard at times. The scariest thing to me now is what happens after I'm done with college. How am I going to pay all of these loans, pay for a wedding, pay for a house, pay for myself to live? I feel like this bill in front of you would make a huge impact, it'd make a real tangible impact, a real relief for young families in this state. I know as a homeowner, if I had a 5% loan right now, I would refinance immediately and students should be able to do that too. And so anything we can do to help our students have a lower payment um, helps the state as a whole and helps our economy.